Good morning. Today is uh, Friday, so I'm just having my breakfast here, as you can see. Uh, just mango first. I just woke up, washed myself, and then now having this mango first because I can eat a lot right away. Oh, it's so good. It's a sunny day, hot day. It hasn't been raining for some time, but it's normal because that's the season now until September or October. I need to buy chia seeds, granola, all the fruits again, but even the organic dried fruits. I had a um, two days ago or two nights ago because I've been eating outside and um, I know there's a lot of pepper put in it so my stomach can't take it also I've been letting go myself drinking cold water or cold drink or anything that's really cold so Luckily, two days ago, two nights ago, I could just watch up my doctor, and she replied to me. It was around midnight, and um, she guided me to take the medicine that she once gave me, which I have not taken. Luckily, it's still valid because I was afraid that it was expired already but she says minimum medicines they last one year so I could take it so I took it it's some sort of analgesic that helped it put me to sleep then yesterday, I just had a little bit of, still not that solid feeling. I took another one, even though actually it wasn't necessary, but I took it. And just now, when I woke up, I did my exercise, my yoga, wash myself, and then here I am having my breakfast. Not even 9 a.m. Feels good. Really good. So I'm looking forward every day now to compile this course. The, the unspoken rules. Uh, style so I think I'm done with the summer section which means all the summer tips on what to wear how to comply an outfit including makeup also I've thrown in the whole lecture or course for summer so I think today I'm going to already publish and then I shall add again I shall compile again the autumn section so let's see I'm going to have it 
not exactly as a course because it's not like I have to really guide you you can just read all from those pages and follow I shall add some kind of um, video demonstration which I'm sure you don't need but there's no harm in giving a bonus <clears throat> and uh, I'm looking forward to finishing <clears throat> from every season so autumn that's going to take some time for me to compile and then winter and spring It's exciting, you know, because if you see Melania Trump, my style is hers in terms of coordinating an outfit together. Um, you see, she used to live in Milan and she tapped onto that, I could see. And that's why on my Facebook page, when President Trump just won the election, I put the similarity of the color combinations and clothes that I have been wearing which she has been wearing too so there's a lot of similarity and I can see that she tapped onto that unspoken rule of style in Milan she, she, she worked there I think and um, that's along the line of style that I introduce you here or I have for you here so if you like to go for the real sexy type I don't offer that if you re if you go for real classic type I don't offer that I go I go for the conform style that can be sexy anytime by just tweaking a little bit that's all or changing your shoes or make it a little bit low cut or heavier makeup or different cut it's just a matter of tweaking so let's see but that's the kind of style that I have in the course for you and um, let me have a sip of my cappuccino which is not as good as in Milan but it's better than nothing so it's not bad it's still made of almond milk but it's not the same as Milan I don't know what it is that in Milan everything tastes better could be the water I think because we can have the same coffee here, we can have the same ice cream here, but it's not the same if you made them here or if you make them outside of Italy. It's the water, in my humble opinion, it's the water that makes the difference. Because the ice cream is so delicious. The, also the ingredients, of course, the fresh ingredients, the cappuccino, the ice cream, the cake, they look simple though. They don't look uh, very, uh, extravagant like other cakes everywhere in the world but the taste is so delicious in Italy mm, and I'm sure in France too those two countries have the best food to me and then the Japanese then the Thai to me those four have the best food in the world This is good almond milk and cappuccino, lighter than the one I have in Milan, which is great because here it's a hot country. So, really good.
That's it.